Hi, my name is Randy, and today we're baking three ingredient cookies. Before we get started, I'd like to introduce my two friends, Paul Woollywood and Moharry Berry, who will be judging the finished product. Do you have any words of advice for me? This recipe's very easy. Don't mess it up. Well, that's very encouraging. These cookies are super delicious, plant-based, and gluten-free. They can also be adapted to be nut-free as well. So, grab your materials, wash your hands, and let's get started. To make your three ingredient cookies, you will need two cups of rolled oats, a half a cup of peanut butter, you can also use Nutella, cashew butter, almond butter, tahini, or sun butter, and three very ripe bananas. If you like, you can also include something yummy, like chocolate chips. To start, preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And prepare your cookie tray. I added a sheet of parchment paper to my cookie tray, but you can also grease it. Set it aside for later. Next, we're going to mash our bananas. Grab a large bowl and peel your bananas into the bowl. Now, I have a really nice potato masher that I'm going to use to mash my bananas, but if you don't have one of those, you can also use a fork. This part might take a little bit of time and might need a little bit of muscle, so you can ask a grown-up for help. Oh yeah. Once your bananas are satisfactorily mashed, we're going to add the other ingredients. Add your two cups of rolled oats and your half a cup of nut or seed butter. Stir to combine. You want to mix really well, get everything nicely combined. Mmm. Looks gooey. At this point, you can add whatever add-ins you have. I have some chopped dark chocolate here, but you can also add chocolate chips or raisins or seeds, other nuts, whatever you like. These cookies don't have any sugar or flour, so you can think of them as like a nice little breakfast snack maybe, or perhaps a little afternoon snack. They're they're basically healthy. All right, once everything is really well combined, grab your cookie sheet. Now, scoop pretty sizable scoops of your cookie dough onto the cookie sheet, leaving a little bit of space in between them until you have no more cookie dough left in your bowl. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to try these cookies out. Looks like I need to make a little bit more room. Lots of cookie dough here. Once your cookies are ready to go, put them in the oven. And bake them for about 10 to 12 minutes. Once they're out of the oven, let them cool completely before you try them. Okay, we'll see you in a few minutes. All right, our cookies are cooled and ready for tasting. Let's see what our judges think. Paul Woollywood and Moharry Berry, I'm excited to hear your thoughts. Delicious. I think you should be very proud. Oh, I don't particularly like peanut butter, but these are pretty good. <gasps> oh. 
And that is how you make three ingredient cookies. Bye!